Oh, anyway, listen, mate. I'm gonna have. To, I'm gonna have to. This has been a great conversation again. But Absolutely. have we covered everything? Is there anything? Any any odds and ends left? Oh, there's at least ten, or seven or eight things I could talk about. But <laughs> I, again, right. I, I, I got to have dinner and go see my wife and kid and everything. And, yeah, I've got. To, I've, got to, and, I've got to enter back into the real world somehow here. Yeah, exactly. But no, we we talked about lots of stuff, and I always enjoy these talks, Perry. I look forward to them so much. Yeah. And, uh, but and I'm looking forward to what happens with the Speak the Future album here. I'm, I'm yeah. really excited about you mixing things, and, and I'm excited to hear the results. And even if they offend me, I'm going to do my best to <laughs> accept them as they are, because I, uh, you know, I mean, I I I know you've written a lot of albums. I, I've written a lot for I've written more than anybody I know, other than yourself. Mm. You know, and um, so if something doesn't sound the way I would make it, doesn't mean it doesn't shouldn't exist. You know, so it's. Uh, and I know that you respect my material and you get what I'm doing. Like, you know, the fact that you, you like the way you're res- responding to the, the lyrics and the content of that new song there you're working on, um, you get it, you get exactly what I'm doing. And I'm, and, and it's, and you also get like the, the whole, like, this could even be real. This could be an autobiography for all you know. <laughs> yes, right. Yeah. And that's what, that's what freaks me out about it because I'm, <laughs> I'm writing these songs and they're coming together in a way that like that's what I'm doing. I'm like I'm writing about my experience more than I'm writing about it. And the abstract idea started, and the farther I get into it, it becomes more of an experience than an idea, um, which is just makes me feel like where do I go from here? You know, like I feel like I've like that song I sent you the the voices and the wires. Uh-huh. Where you, I think you reacted to it like you're like holy shit, you're right. This song is something else. Like when I finished writing that song, I felt like I I sat down and went like like how do I what do I do next? And I haven't done much since then. Like I, every time I do, I'm like, I don't know. I'm not sure if this is worth doing. Give yourself a minute. Cole, it always comes back in my experience. I've had I've had several of those where you where where I've thought I, I, that that might be it. You know, I, every time. Well, not every time, but quite a lot of the times when I've done something that I'm really really pleased with, I kind of go, well, that might be it, but that would be that would be okay if it was it because that was pretty good. You know, so there's that. So, so you you can always have that comfort. Which is if that's it, that you're right. if that's it, then that's it. You know, if I if I never wanted to play a note of music again, it would be fine because I've got all of this. The, the I really believe the music is forever. The music the music will outlast us, and people will discover it. You know, as long as we can keep it online somewhere. There you go. <laughs> you know, as long as we can keep it keep it going. You know, but uh, yeah. I used to think to myself, if I can release ten albums before I die. I, I have satisfied my musical journey, you know, and I'm far surpassed it and I'm just getting better, I think. So, mm. you know, maybe I'll aim for 85 like you. Yeah, well, I, <laughs> yes, I, I aimed, my aim was one for every year of my life, but it's way beyond that now. Because at, at, at one time I was producing a lot, so, and some of them are quite short, so there's that too. But yeah, I, th- I think uh, I'm 64 now, so I think I'm ahead of the game. So that's good. There you go. <laughs> All right, brother. Well, right. Good chatting with you as always, man. Talk soon, eh?